So this is called Miji Nail Art and it's quite unique in the sense, first of all, it's regular nail polish. So if you open it up, there's a brush just like any regular nail polish. So like I've done over here, you can see I've started by doing a base coat. That's where you're going to use the brush of the nail polish. The best part about it is when you put the lid back on and pull the top off, check this out, you actually have a pen for decorating. So there's a fine tip there that you can actually detail and decorate on your fingernails. So I'm very quickly going to show you, <clears throat> I've already painted a few of the nails here, but very quickly I'm going to use the nail polish brush here and just paint the fingernail. Now by painting the fingernail you have your base coat. The good part about this is that you don't have to wait for the nail polish to dry. In fact, you can go right into doing a demonstration on the wet polish. So now, if I take my nail polish pen, <clears throat> which I'm using the green right now, and you'll notice that the more you squeeze on the bottle, the more nail polish comes out and onto your fingernails. So if you want a large amount or if you want a very small amount, you decide how much comes out by how much you squeeze. Now what I'm going to do here on the wet nail polish is just take that, that tip and draw a line across. Don't worry about it being wet because it's all going to dry together. The nice part is it's not going to smudge or smear. I'm going to go back with the white <clears throat> and watch this here. Just take the white. Again, the more that I squeeze on it, the more comes out onto the fingernail. And this is super fun for little girls. They absolutely love this. Now remember, by using the fine detailing pen, you control how much comes out, but if I squeeze and drag, you're going to get some pretty cool effects with it. And this, the little girls absolutely love. For sleepovers or slumber parties, you can see where you're going to get some pretty fun designs with it, and I'm just going to go back and touch it up a bit. And that's still wet. It takes about 60 seconds for it to dry, and you'll find that you're going to get some really cool designs with it. And you can see that nice little watermelon that we did there. Isn't that fun? Now, <clears throat> over here on the smaller fingernail, I'm going to do one that is extremely fun to do as well. And I'm trying to show you some kid designs right now because kids love nail polish. And having a nail polish pen that's easy to work with, it's a plastic squeeze bottle. So the more you squeeze, the more comes out. And that means that the kids of all ages can actually use these pens for decorating and detailing. <clears throat> so now what I'm going to do here is draw a straight line across. So we fill in the bed. So we've used red for our base, and by using the black detailing pen, you can get some pretty detailed artwork. And here's our little ladybug. Isn't that adorable? Now I'm going to go back and add some eyes here. You can be creative, do whatever you like. It's all up to you. And the best part is, <clears throat> you don't have to be artistic. As you can see so far, all I've done are dots and lines. Little dot just to get nice fine details on the eye and check that out. Now, for adults, obviously I say kids, but kids of all ages are going to love this. And I actually go to the salon and have pedicures done all the time. But this here is where I find most women love for decorating and detailing. I'm going to do two, three, four, five little dots, followed by a different color in the middle. Then you have yourself. A little daisy. <clears throat> Go back with a little green in there. And there you have yourself your little detail. And of course, like I said earlier, women spend a fortune getting this done at the salon. And if you did do that at a salon when you're getting a pedicure or manicure, they usually charge an extra five dollars for a little decal decal like that. And of course it's just one, two, three, four, and five that quick, that easy, and again within 30 to 60 seconds your nail designs are dry. <clears throat> I'm just going to come in a little closer now so that you can actually see that. There's our ladybug that we did. There's our little flowers. There's the watermelon which is the favorite. <clears throat> and I'm going to come back here and do something else here. These are the packages that they come in. There's the silver box, which are the regular primary colors. 
course you have uh, eight pens in every kit and let me show you just real quickly the pens come apart in the middle so that you have individual bottles that freestand so when you want to paint with the brush you can they link together with a little connector which means that now you have two pens that create like a an actual art decorating pen tool each side has its own brush and tips on it so you can work with it but in this set here you get the eight primary colors the white and the black for decorating and detailing then on the gold box we have all the sparkle glitter sets <clears throat> and of course uh, this color set is really popular with the teenage girls over here we have pastel colors and if you shake up the nail polish before using it yeah, you'll find that the colors are really nice, soft pastel colors. Little girls go crazy for them. I always find in the summer months those are really nice, soft colors. This is um, very popular in the last couple of years. Neon colors are back in style. And these are for the people that are a little bit more fun, a little bit funky, those colors. And then this set here, <clears throat> which is normally a salon style pen. Uh, you can see the colors in there are more geared towards doing things like French manicures, which brings me to my next point. I mentioned earlier that you have a brush for decorating and detailing, but that fine tip that we're working with is gonna allow you to do things like a French manicure in no time. So what I'm gonna do here is just draw a straight line across, squeeze, and go back and fill that in. And you'll find that the more you squeeze, the more nail polish is coming out and onto your fingertip. And that <clears throat> is a professional salon style French manicure in no time. So you're going to find that instead of going to the salon to do your manicure, you can do it yourself at home. And don't worry if you make a mistake, it's just regular nail polish. You can use any nail polish remover to take it off. It comes off that quick and easy. And once it's dry, just go over it very lightly with a soft peach or a pink and you have yourself a traditional French manicure in no time. So by using the brush, you're gonna get some amazing designs. Again, depending on the size of the nail, you can get some pretty artistic decorative designs. And don't limit yourself <clears throat> just to the designs that I've done here. In fact, every box of Miji nail art comes with a set of instructions that show you how to do different designs. And as you can see over here, these are some of the designs that uh, we've done in our spare time. Obviously you can see it's a little bit more decorative and detailed, a little bit more artistic, but you don't have to be artistic. The more you play with these pens, the better you're going to get. So you can pick these up at any major trade show. Uh, they're usually found at all the major fairs and exhibitions. But if you just want to pick up a set today, you can go to MijiNailArt.com. So M-I-G-I-N-A-I-L-A-R-T.com.